This right. middle section, you, you do have some natural um, methods as well for Absolutely. people who want to use a, ma a natural So this one. is for, um, you know, roses, trees. Um, so neem oil is a very organic, natural um, fungicide and insecticide. Okay. Um, it will um, treat trees, um, plants, uh, all sorts of different so things. So some of my azaleas this time of year, they come out and the leaves are pale yellow and they have like a mold black spot on them. Yeah. Something like that so would So neem oil trick. will work, work really well. Um, like I said, it's it's a natural product. So, you know, you're not going to shock the plant or anything mm -hmm. like that. Okay. So. And you pointed right. to rat X. I see that as... Yes. Ooh. So <laughs> rats and mice um, are definitely uh, active right now. Um, this is a non-toxic um, product. It can be used uh, indoors as well. Um, very good product. Um, you know, you just pile it up in a certain area where you've seen them active, and uh, they go get it. Okay. I want to get serious if we can for a second. This Corey. is really what Rod cares about. Talk about. I have never <laughs> had a mole problem like I had last year. I tried all the pellets. I mean, I bet I spent 50 bucks on pellets. You know what? Five bucks per little thing or something like that. Didn't have any success. Tell me about this guy right here. So these are very effective. Uh, this is a solar powered unit and then we have a battery operated unit right there. Um, around the $20 price range, basically it, it uses sonar. It makes a, a loud hmm. beeping noise that humans or pets cannot hear, so it's safe around pets. Um, and basically oh, wow. you shove it in that active hole and it will deter them away. They they'll they'll run to your neighbor's them, yard, that's what will happen. Yes. Okay, I like that. If I see the moles in my neighbor's house and I'm like, then success. Si send, send your neighbors my way. <laughs> <laughs> they'll be using it, sending them right okay. back. So, right. okay, one other one Rod was very interested in, this one. Yes, yeah, right. so these are these are poison wor uh, mole worms. More expensive than the pellets, if I'm yes, correct. Yes, yeah, so, right? they, they, so moles um, actually eat earthworms. So this is a very earthworm-like product. Um, it's a poison. You put it in active holes. Um, those flags that it comes with are flags you use to mark to where mark. you've seen mm -hmm. the active uh, okay. mole um, in that area. You so. know what I've noticed okay. too? Those um, stink bugs, a problem. I know it's been a topic of research for um, ag mm -hmm. researchers in Washington. Yes. Does anything really work on them? So Taro makes a product that we do carry and it, it's, a, it's a spray. Um, basically it's a spray on contact that you spray on them when you see them. Um, they're a very tough bug. They're to, they yeah, are hard. But uh, it does kill them and it doesn't create, because uh, if you kill them by stomping on them, mm -hmm. it'll actually attract more. So this which product, I, really? which yeah. I learned the hard way yes. <laughs> last year. Yeah. All, right, All right, Corey Greason with Park Rose Hardware mm -hmm. in Vancouver. Thank you for the great suggestions.